Hey guys. So, I'm gonna try not to cry. I'm like, mentally breaking down, so I can't, I don't know if I can not stop crying or not. I'm just like, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna share my Ramadan experience with people. I'm gonna try to just like ignore hate. Come on to my videos. But I can't do it anymore. I can't. I'm done. I'm tired of being the beating post of an incredibly disgusting, toxic community literally literally trying to destroy a human being and ooh trouble in paradise i don't know where salah is i guess not supporting me right now i guess it's ramadan salah at least had to appear like a devout muslim and avoid stressing himself out especially if stress is primarily from hashtag foodie beauty, it's like avoiding to do sinful stuff on Catholic Holy Week. I just got home and saw this and so I have to go find out what's going on. But first, I just gotta say, I love this for her. Salah will be out with his friends. Usually, women are left at home in the evenings to spend time with other females. She wasn't prepared for this. Karma. Honeymoon phase is over. The illusion has been shattered. And she rages on Ramadan isn't that bad with. Chantal lies so much. I think this is just another money grab. Well, that's a very cynical attitude. Aw, shame. I've honestly never not known where my husband is. He's probably with his parents and family breaking fast. They didn't invite her because she would eat too much? Or because they don't know she exists? My theory. I am loving this right now. He's in the chat though. What did she do that he wouldn't be supporting her? Wow. But we knew this would happen, right? If she is still alive, someone ask if she has her passport. BIB is trying to get her to stay throwing money at her. You have been trying hard. New country, new marriage, away from family, trying hard with new religion. God is proud of you. Please, put your happiness and mental health first. Just remember, they are all your biggest fans, lol. Everything they say is just projection. It's not personal towards you, it's their own hate for themselves. FFG Cinderella's wicked stepmother. 2. Foodie beauty, the key is when you try for yourself and not to show others. F what they think. You don't need evaluation. If anything, even if you're progressing, they'll try to drag you down to their level of misery. <laughs> That's what it's all for. And those idiots can't see it. Her VIBs are so dumb. Give me a money, punk. God is proud of you. Really? Probably at his apartment or something, but I don't know. Why would anyone support her? Yeah, sorry, I don't believe her. The paycheck was low and she needs money and super chats. She is, as usual, full of BS big time. Definitely hiding from you. Maybe he couldn't stand the blistering 70-ish degree temperature inside the shipping container and got heat stroke. I bet it is the heat combined with rotting barracuda and tuna. Barracuda! He's red rooming it. You know what? I love this the most. I love it. Happy Friday. Now it makes sense. I think Salah was out last night and hashtag foodie beauty was freaking out about it. She's now again threatening him that she will not do YouTube anymore. So he will do whatever she says again. I think it's to manipulate him. It has nothing to do with anyone else. Hashtag Salah and Chantal. I've decided I'm going to take a break from YouTube and focus on myself. 
Also, I see vultures are already picking apart and turning what I say into their own fact when they know nothing as usual. I made an error when I said he can't go to Syria. I meant we because we will always travel together. Duh. Syria is dangerous to travel to for anyone right now. I really think your community is majorly messed up if you feel it's okay to dive into personal lives when you don't know someone's story fully. It's also not okay to mess with the livelihood of innocent people. It's not okay to pick apart and body shame us for ours on a live stream. It's honestly deplorable and these same drain rats have the nerve to call me vile. I know I have tried this before but I am done with YouTube for a while. Hopefully forever. I may seek another platform in the future because I will miss my beezers but I will not be a part of a platform of vultures and disgusting people. A reaction channel calling me a beast but supports this creature? Also, dummy, he's lived here his whole life, him and his family. He doesn't need to go to Syria, moron. We will stay here and also travel for many years. I am using him for sponsorship as he is the one sponsoring me right now. You know nothing as usual. There are no disgusting morons like this here and I will never live in the West again. I hate this disgusting mentality. Go have fun getting content with your own sad pathetic lives. You are literally picking apart my life when you have none yourselves and this is why you hide. Cowards. All. This is how you losers spend your lives. Lol. I can't. And I was right. She just privated the Beezers Unite live. This hashtag foodie beauty rage is all about Salah not being with her yesterday. Prove me wrong. Oh my god, you are right. That was for him, not for us. Does he not get he's not in love with her? He might be in like with her, but that is it. I think this is for views. She knows people are getting tired of her ass. Honestly, I think this too. She always quits YouTube when she's mad at Salah. She knows YouTube money is the only hold she has over him. She quits until Salah either gives her eggplant or affirms her in some other way. Then she's back with the lives. Yeah, Tracy, I'm not going to be on YouTube uh, as a platform anymore. I can't. I can't do it. It's just, it's not even worth it for me it's not worth it i mean i put i spend all this time on a video um whether people think it's garbage or not they sure qu are quick to use it for their own content i know you guys love me and i'm i don't know what i'm gonna do um if i'm gonna continue on social media if i do it's not going to be this platform because I've complained so many times to YouTube about how, like, just how, how much, like, I've just reported so many times just the most inappropriate things, and they don't care. Like, they just don't care about the mental well being of their creators. All alone in your shoebox for $1. Salah, come give Chantal a hug or a handshake, lol. Tracy, I'm waiting her to end the live to let her rest and hug her, lol. <laughs> I'll be as sweet as pie tomorrow? Oh, you know it. You know I'm gonna manipulate the fuck out of you. And you're gonna eat it up and you're gonna watch me. 